and today we're taking a look at a tactical credit card wallet tool with emergency whistle. A credit card tool in case an emergency can even save your life or it could make that difficult situation a lot easier and this tool you could get under $11 if you're interested we're gonna leave a link on the description so this particular one is a 12 in 1 it comes with an emergency whistle and a little bit more of two and a half feet paracord when stretched you can get three feet and these two can come in handy at any moment if you don't want to carry it in your wallet with the paracord you can hang it on your neck and that's great when you're going hiking or camping. It's bigger than your average multi-tool, but it comes with features that others don't have. But it's still compact that it could fit on your wallet with ease. Even though it won't fit on the credit card insert on your wallet, but it would fit in the other compartments with no problem. So let's go ahead and take a look at this bad boy. And these are the things that we get in the box. We have the manual, or as we like to call it, barbecue paper. The first thing that we have is our whistle. It feels very well made and compact, which makes it great. The metal construction plus how small it is means you could carry it anywhere, from your pockets to your keychain or in the paracord in your neck. The first thing that we're going to look at is the knife. What makes this knife easier to use than other ones is the plastic grip and the curve at the end. This makes it a lot easier to get a better grip on the knife. On the knife is located the hex tool as well. The knife is composed of three parts, the serrated side at the bottom and the flat blade on the top. And on the other side, we have the fire starter hook. And you can also use the hook for a fishing line cutter. You're not gonna become a carpenter with this knife, but it will get the job done for small branches. Our second tool is the fire starter, and this is one that you use in combination with the knife. We place the fire starter on the hook, having the knife at the bottom. We get a good grip on it and then strike it like your life depends on it. And if it doesn't work on the first time, just give up and ask your neighbor for a lighter. But for real, get that lighter. And if he doesn't have one, then maybe you're dead. No, but for real, you are. But if you don't wanna die, then you try again. In our third tool, we have the opener. And as you can tell, the plastic makes it easier to grip. And you already know what you do with openers. You can take that ice cold, bubbly bottle of water and open it. Here at the Stata Box team, we couldn't wait and we drank them all. Hopefully we could finish the video in one piece. If you're watching the video, then it means we survived. Then on each side, we have the screwdrivers, one for flathead and the other one for Phillips screw. And remember, this is not meant to replace your drill unless you have a lot of time to spare. So if you want to cancel that gym membership, this is the time to do it. But in case an emergency, this could get the job done. And our fourth tool is the tweezers. And we do like that they're made of metal. So now you know you don't have to use your hands to pick up random things you find in the woods. Our fifth tool is a toothpick. And this one is made of plastic. And I think plastic is the way to go. I don't know how metal and gums would have gone. So that's a thumbs up for the engineering team. At the bottom side of the tool, we have a ruler to measure up to six centimeters. And at the bottom of the tool, we can measure up to three full inches. And this is great to have if you want to become an architect, because the thing that you want when you're getting chased by bears, foxes, and wolves, it's that almighty ruler to know what three inch stick you need to defend yourself. But if you're not gonna encounter animals in the wild, this is a great thing to have. If we look at the right corner of the tool, we have our magnifying glass. And it's very surprising, it does look good. 
To the left side of the magnifying glass, we have our compass. And this is a great tool to have in case you don't want to use your GPS to go to work. You'll get there in no time. And our last tool is the blade sharpener. And this was the only tool that we can say was a hit and miss. It's very awkward to place the knife to sharpen, but overall, everything else worked great. Don't forget, if you liked the video, please give us a thumbs up. That really helps. If you have any questions, place them in the comment section below. Don't forget to subscribe, follow us on social media. Thank you for watching. And here's a link to our latest video.